Hello and welcome to today's video on the Boston Red Sox's off-season moves. The Red Sox may make one or two more moves as they aim to compete in 2023. As you may know, Boston has had a tumultuous off-season so far, and there is still a long time before spring training begins. After finishing with a record of 78-84 in 2022, the Red Sox have had to fill several holes in their roster. One position that is still a question mark for the team is catcher. Currently, the Red Sox only have Reese McGuire and prospect Connor Wong on their 40-man roster. However, there is a player still available in free agency who may be a good fit for Boston. That player is Gary Sanchez, former catcher for the New York Yankees and Minnesota Twins. Sanchez may not have the best defensive reputation, but he has posted some of his best framing numbers in recent years and has thrown out a lower percentage of wild pitches in his career. Hey there, thanks for watching this news update. If you enjoyed it, make sure to show your support by liking the video. Liking the video helps YouTube recommend more Red Sox news to you in the future. Thanks for your support and keep watching for more updates. Additionally, Sanchez is known for his power at the plate. The Red Sox finished 2022 with the 20th highest number of home runs as a team, and after losing Xander Bogarts and JD Martinez, they may be in need of a player like Sanchez to provide some pop in the lineup. Sanchez has consistently hit double-digit home runs throughout his career and has even had seasons with over 30 home runs. He is expected to receive a contract with an annual value under $7 million, which the Red Sox should be able to afford. The Red Sox have also recently attempted to trade for former Oakland Athletics catcher Sean Murphy, but were unsuccessful. It remains to be seen if the team will make a move for Sanchez or continue their search for a new backstop. Regardless of the outcome, a move for the former Yankees catcher may not be the most flashy, but it could definitely be worth it for the Red Sox. Thank you for joining us and we hope you'll stay tuned for more updates on the Red Sox's off-season moves.